All right, guys, welcome back to my let's play of Clock Tower, where we left off. We are playing as Helen. She's taking a nap, and the door is ringing. God damn it. Must be Rose's stupid boyfriend or something. She's not even waking up. She's kind of like in this giant lump of bed here. So let, let's go. Let's go knock on the door. Well, now who is it? Let's let's open the door and show it. Show her boyfriend. Not to be so rude about knocking on the door. Yeah, totally him. How rude. How rude. <gasps> oh no, this is Scissor Man. Oh no, this is Scissor Man. So this is evasions, you know, Scissor Man will try chase us, all that fun stuff. There's a fire extinguisher here. Let's use it. Should come out of this door, shouldn't he? Oh, there he is. Surprise. Okay, so that's that. That's how the encounter works with Scissor Man. You discover Scissor Man, you evade him, you call it a day. Let's go back in there. He should still be there, shouldn't he? Nope. He pissed off. Alright, let's go look at that fire extinguisher that we used. A fire extinguisher. Alright, let's check the exit. You know, we could totally exit now, right? Right? An emergency exit. That's odd. It doesn't even budge. Ah, the worst worst emergency exit door I've ever seen. Let's try this area. Actually, we should go talk to Rose here. This is the men's lounge. Alright, let's go check on Rose here, because she's still sleeping. You know, her boyfriend is dead on the ground. Apparently he wanted to get in here for some little nighttime loving, if you know what I mean. Oh, wait, nope. No nope, boyfriend's gone. And I guess hell, Rose is gone too? I don't see anything. It's a giant wooden... Yeah, there's nothing there. Cheap, uncomfortable bunk beds, famous for being squeaky. Well, Rose is gone. <laughs> Rose, I guess, decided to piss off. Who knows where she is? I guess we could just leave. Rose must have got the smart idea and jumped out the window, you know? Okay, well, if that's the case, let's do some exploring. Let's try to get the heck out of here. Let's try this door first. Professor Furio's lab. There's no way to get in the lab. Also, that, that text went by way too fast. Let's check out the men's washroom. Can we go in the men's washroom? It is a horror game. We should be able to enter in there. We need to find some stuff for survival. Alright. Oh, we can cook in the mirror. Oh, maybe not. Oh, actually, sink, 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 sink. Somewhere her hands are colored blood. Huh? Alright, let's check the bathroom. Everything seems normal. Something told me Scissor Man was in there. <gasps> dun 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 dun. Okay, well. Let's check the other room. There was that... There's a door here. Let's go in here. Let's see what we can find in here. Oh! <gasps> oh no, it's Scissor Man, and he programmed all the computers to type in kill. Oh my god, Scissor Man is such a professional. How did he do that? I. He's very skilled. Let's go to the washroom. Let's escape. Let's go by, you know, let's use the washroom here. Oh, I guess, you know, I guess Sizzaman didn't want to check the men's bathroom. Just 
just I guess he didn't want to get in there and you know find out where we went whatever okay well if that's the case let's go back in there All right, let's just, you know, investigate here. Let's see. Let's check the computers out. I wonder if there is something here that might be useful. Maybe. Let's check this computer. There's nothing abnormal. Okay, well, but this one. Also, I didn't... Oh. There are some tools here. I wonder if it's being repaired. This might be useful. We now have pliers. I don't think I mentioned this, but double, like I said, double tapping to run, it's really hit and miss. A personal computer is on the table. It should have access to the internet. So we can Google get help. So yeah. A cheap desk. They've got budget problems here, too. So yeah, the running mechanics in this game is really <laughs> questionable. Um, sometimes they'll run, sometimes they won't. Based on the mood they feel. Alright, let's take the elevator. We got an elevator. Why, why are we taking the stairs? I think the elevator's the best option here. Alright, let's waffle around. We're in three, let's try two. Okay, let's go through this door. Let's let's explore. Like I said, we're exploring this area. We're here. Why not? Okay, well, I guess we'll check the couch. A sofa. There are small shoe prints on it. These shoe prints, they look like they were made by a child. Da 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 da. Let's check out this magazine rack. A magazine rack. There are many academic journals. Anything else? Oh, wait, no, 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 that one. No. Uh, let's check out this plant. A flower pot. Okay, fine, it's a flower pot. Not a plant. Let's go in this door here. Okay, let's do some exploring. Let's go get this window. There's no sign of anyone. The fax rings. <gasps> the fax machine rings. What is it? What is it? Okay, we'll, we'll check it out in a second. Must be something important. Is there anything else I can interact with while we're here? The phone. Department. There's been a murder. Come quickly, please. Please relax, ma'am. Did you see the murderer? He's the one with the giant scissors. Scissor man. You've heard of him, haven't you? If this is a prank phone call. Wait. Well, damn it. Uh, let's check this desk, since it's the only one that pops up here. There's nothing that might be useful. All right, let's check out this fax. What's so special? What happened here? Someone is sending a fax from the building. The written is weak and unsteady. I'm coming to get you. Huh. Aw, go get Susan, man. He worked so hard to send that. That is adorable. Copy with a built-in fax machine. The power is out here, too. Oh, the building is completely cut off from the outside. Oh, spook Freddy. Let's check these ladders here. Or ladders. Lockers. Dresses, skirts, neckties, and umbrellas. Okay. The owner is well prepared. Let's check this one. It's locked. What about this one? There are several stuffed animals inside. I wonder why these are here at the university. 
Who knows? A flashlight. This might be useful. You now have a flashlight. Groovy. Let's get out of here. We got a scary fax. Also oh, spooky. Oh, oh, so spooky. That scissor man. He knows how I work this technology so much. Okay. So, let's continue. Let's check out other places here. Let's go, oh, ladies' washroom. Let's go into the ladies' washroom. See what we can find in, you know, the ladies' toiletry, dormitory, washroom thingy. There's a sink. Her face caught in the mirror. It is pale and drawn, a face she has never seen before. Okay. Well, we got two bathrooms. Let's check the far one first. Everything seems normal. Scissor Man is coming. I can feel it. Now let's check this one. Rose is covered with blood. Uh... Well, we found Rose, guys. We found Rose. Murder solved. Mystery solved, not the murder. Well, both, actually. We know who killed him. Killed her. We know what the what, what weapon, too. And we know it's in the bathroom. I think we won our game of Clue, guys. Um, let's go into here. See if we can find anything special in here. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff we can interact with. There are many files and cases of mental illness. Okay, what about this one? Records of criminals, professors... Sisman's profile is here too! Okay, Professor Barton has profiled. I don't know how Sisman has a record. That seems a little weird. Danny's desk. It's really messy. Let's check out Harris's desk. Harris's desk. There are many cutout articles on the clock tower. Case scattered all over it. Harris was quite energetic in his investigation of Scissorman. All right, the mask is still here. Apparently, Scissorman doesn't like the knockoff mask. Just wanted to leave it here. Helen's desk. Oh no, I left the key to the office laying here. You now have the office key. Cool. We can use it for whatever we want now. Beth's desk. It is cluttered with stuffed animals. Looks like Beth forgot these. There's a spray can of mace on her desk. This must be one with the powerful, irritating smell. Okay, let's check out this. Volumes on psychoanalysis. Some of them were written by Professor Barton. Old criminal records. Reading too many of these could drive you crazy. Barton's desk. That's right, Professor Barton's phone should be able to call outside. The line is dead. Damn you, Barton. Anything else? No. Let's go into here. I can get into the therapy room with this. I'm assuming you should use the office key. Just a hunch. All right, let's go around in here. A treatment bed. Patient files are stored here. Bottles of medicine. Anybody notice what I noticed? Anybody notice? Something's gone. Something's missing. Something's gone. Ooh. There are files on the desk. There is something written on the file. You discovered hint number four. Anybody know something's missing? Something giant pair of scissors? Spooky. Spooky, spooky. All right, let's get out of here.
Okay, there, actually, there's this we wanted to check out. What is this? What is this paper here? The staff whereabouts are recorded on the blackboard. Everyone's gone home except for Helen and two others. Rose and Baker. Well, Baker died. Rose died. So I think there's only one person really going to try to leave this building now. Professor Mari Kunis's laboratory. The door won't open. Damn it. Let's try this exit. Emergency exit is security locked. Well, Pickles. I guess we'll head- use the elevator. And we'll head downstairs. Oh no! Oh no, it's Scissor Man! Oh no! Oh no! Alright. You know what? Actually, let's go through this one. Let's go through this one. Let's use the washroom again. Oh yeah, totally walked past us. There we go. Okay, we're good. We're fine. Let's take the stairs this time. So let's head down. Let's go to the first floor. Should be able to escape. Okay, so we won't use the elevator anymore. Um, let's get out of here. The door is tightly shut. Well then, there's no way out. Let's check around here. Oh, I hear some dripping noise. Now security will surely come. If I can somehow stay alive till then. Dun 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 dun. Oh, there's a phone here. The phone is dead. Let's check the chair here. No need to sit down now. Oh, let's check on this. And oh, what's that dripping sound? There's a key lying on the table. What's this? You now have storage key. Okay, cool. Chair has been knocked over. I wonder what happened. I don't know. I, I see this, though. A sofa the security guards often use for naps. Oh, we could check this out. Let's check it out. Something sounds like water dripping. Da, 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 da. Also, I like to point out the man's socks match the same as the wall. But we'll leave him hanging for now. Okay. Well, that was kind of scary. Let's check out this bathroom here. Oh, we got another faucet. A sink. Everything seems normal. What about this bathroom? There's no sign of scissor man. That's good. I guess we'll get out of here now. Okay, let's go over here. We got this door. Got that door. And we got some lockers. Ooh, let's check the lockers out. It's locked. Oh no! Oh yeah, Susie Van. The gasp. I guess time to run. Let's go in here. 
I wonder if we can get him here. Oh no, uh, box. Let's hide in a box. This man will surely not notice us in a box this tiny. Well, I guess not. I guess we were totally incognito here. Well, before we explore this area, let's let's try that other room. Let's go into that other door. See if we can actually enter that door. This one here. L Research lab currently not being used. The door is locked and won't open. There's no way to open this door. Well, we could try using fours. Alright, so we opened up, I think, one and two. We didn't open three and four. Let's try. It's locked. Staff lockers. Okay. Well, I guess we're done here. Let's go into this room here. Yo. Okay, I, you know what? We're going to the washroom. Let's go to the washroom. It seems like the washrooms work the best against his men. Apparently, he is weak if he is exploring them. Is totally, totally weak against entering washrooms, guys. I don't know how Rose, you know, got murdered in the bathroom. Apparently, this man doesn't want to enter the washrooms. All right, well, let's go into here. And let's explore here. It seems empty. A wooden box is stuffed with papers. Probably old research pit documents. Oh, we already clicked on this one. Oops, 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 oops. Everything seems normal. Alright. I think this box at least is the same. Oh no, interact with it. If I could only find something to use as a weapon. Well, that was maze. There's nothing inside except a scrap peep piece of paper. Um, I'm surprised Helen never took the mace with her. Just saying. There are many parts for computers. Um. Okay, let's check this red door. This door should lead to the parking lot outside. Huh. The door knob is wired shut. Oh, that's right. This door isn't supposed to be used. But I wonder if I can do something to the wire. Well, yes, we can, Helen. We have this biffy pliers. Let's ply our way out of here. Ply. Ha huh, ha. Huh. It worked. All right, now let's get out of here. It's even locked, too. Well, guess what? We have a key. <gasps> Let's use the key. It opened. I gotta get to my car fast. Alright, so that is scenario one. So, we got some items. We got, we met Scissor Man. We know his weakness is washrooms. Um, yeah, you know, we did pretty good today. We, we did well. Um, before I continue, guys, I'm gonna save, of course.
Man, the beep name is going on. We haven't solved the last case yet, and are now another mass murder. And you're saying the murderer is Scissorman? But it's true. I saw him clearly. Oh boy, oh boy. I sure hope you weren't daydreaming with Jennifer. Well, we're done questioning you for now. You can go on home now, Teach. Hmm. Oh, but don't you go anywhere too far for a while. Because I'll probably have to call you in again. Soon. I know, Gots. Okay, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you're enjoying my Let's Play Clock Tower. As usual, do let me know. Like, comment, subscribe, check out my other Let's Plays as well. All that fun stuff. You guys have a good day, and I'll see you next episode. Bye!